everyone. I'm Dr. Sabina Rao. I'm a psychiatrist at Columbia UCSR Jaipur Road and today I am going to be telling you all about stress and what are the things one can do to manage stress. As the pandemic uh, you know goes on, it's been about 8 months and we're still in the pandemic and the vaccine is not yet on the horizon. The news changes every day. The stress levels of people who thought that a vaccine is coming has now gone up because the vaccine is uh, is as a ways off um this in a lot of people is creating a lot of stress and uh, and many people think that they are not able to handle this properly they feel that they're not strong enough uh, many people feel that the idea of working from home multitasking from home taking care of the family taking care of their elderly parents is becoming too much hence across the board a lot of people are a lot more stressed i think when the pandemic started it seemed a little bit easier because we thought we had an end in sight even though all the statistics said that it will take at least a year it might take 2 years if you look at the old pandemic from 100 years ago that took 2 years but to be human is to be hope hopeful so we were hoping this would end very quickly now it's the month of november the year is almost over and the end is yet to come for the pandemic i would like to suggest to people to spend less time looking at the statistics and data on the pandemic stop looking out for the vaccine when it comes it will come and everyone will get to know try to be very careful when you read the news on whatsapp and other forms of social media because not everything on social media is true be very careful when they say things like salt water gargle or uh you know any kind of spray up your nose is going to prevent you from getting covid so what i'm telling people is be aware and be careful and and reading information that's first of all not necessarily true and reading more and more about the pandemic is only going to make you more anxious so do other things exercise spend time with your family watch funny things on tv i'm not saying avoid the you know the internet altogether i'm just saying spend more time on doing fun things within your limitations Uh, another thing i want to bring up is if you think you're not able to handle it please please seek help please seek help of a mental health professional seek help of either a therapist a counselor or even a psychiatrist a uh, psychiatrist as i've said in many of my talks is somebody with an md in psychiatry they are doctors uh, a good therapist would be somebody who has been doing this for a while can help you deal with your stress can help you figure out ways in your circumstance as to how to le- reduce the levels of your stress a therapist can come up with ideas you couldn't think of because you've been so stressed on how to overcome this time how to uh, adjust to the times that you're stuck in many people think that a therapist would help them and that they have to see them only once or twice i think that's a very big misconception when stress has been around for a while like for the last say 10 months or even one year or even two years and maybe your stress started way before the pandemic did it's not possible for the level of anxiety to come down within one or two sessions with a therapist so a therapist is not going to spend 3 hours with you at one shot and help you alleviate your stress a therapist is going to spend about 50 minutes to an hour on helping you find ways after they understand you to how to reduce stress. So a therapy uh session would last an hour and it would be at least 10 to 14 sessions before you're going to start seeing changes in your own mental health. A psychiatrist of course can prescribe medicines that would do the same in the same frame of time. So my suggestion advice to everyone if you notice that your stress is overwhelming, find ways to distract, do fun things, spend less time uh, on reading about the current health pandemic we are in and please please seek help if you think that a mental health professional can help you take care stay safe everyone